In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a PowerPoint file to Easy Worship. And uh, if you watched the earlier video about how how to add a um, a video to uh, Easy Worship, it's pretty much the same process, except that instead of selecting Media, you will select Presentations. And once I have selected Presentations. I'm going to go over and just right click in the in here in this area and it's and, and be very careful that you read right here it says import presentation file and import PowerPoint file in this case we're importing a PowerPoint file so we want to make sure to click that and and then it brings me to in this case it, it defaulted me to our downloads folder and so we see all of these PowerPoint files in here. Um, you know, you're going to be looking for one you might have just downloaded and needed to add to um, to Easy Worship. So let's say, for example, uh, you're going to add identity theft into that. So you just simply click identity theft and click open. And you can see right here, identity theft comes in. Uh, and when it gets, uh, see it's kind of a little blue boxed and faded looking. And when it's fully imported, it will uh, come to be seen uh, like the rest of the PowerPoints. And then of course in the same uh, manner that you would add a video, you just, you can click and drag this over and put it in your, uh, in your file. Or you can uh, right click it. Uh, and delete it out of there the same way. If you were ready to get rid of it out of this, uh, out of Easy Worship, and let me uh, advise you, this will not delete this video from your computer. It will only delete it out of Easy Worship. So just click the delete button. It asks me if I'm wanna, sure I want to do that, and then I delete it, and it's no longer there. Now it's still in my. Uh, still my schedule over here so I'm just going to remove it from the schedule but that's how you add and how you delete a PowerPoint uh, file from Easy Worship and this is really the same way that you will uh, would delete uh, any media whether it be video uh, add or delete media whether it be video or pictures hope this helps